got so many colors. It's like candies. We're talking about fancy colored diamonds today. Actually, I don't think people know what fancy colored diamonds are. They, they may have heard it and they know canaries. Maybe they've heard about pink diamonds because of J-Lo. Yeah, most people know colorless diamonds. Right. They say white, but it's, what it is really is actually colorless. It's right. not white. But the, the world of natural fancy colored diamonds is amazing because there's so many colors. The most common one is the yellow. They also have a second tone in them. They could have. So this is like a pure yellow. Right. It's an 811, pure, fancy yellow. I love this one because it's really pure. It really pure. shows. Yeah, yeah, it really shows. It's vibrant, right? Yeah. It shows yeah. the color. Now, even the fancy yellow could have more of a, on a lemon side, or it could be more on the honey side also. So that's like a tone. But it could also have a secondary color in it. So for example, here on this one, this is a 10 karat round, and this one has a slight brown in it. So it's fancy, deep, brownish yellow. It's the primary color, which is yellow. Then there is a diff another hue, which is brownish. And then there is the intensity, and it could be light yellow, uh, fancy yellow, intense or deep yellow, which makes the depth of the color. Correct. All right. It could also be dark, and the ultimate, the ultimate, ultimate top of the line is the vivid. Vivid. If one is diamond is a vivid, and it's pure vivid, then it's the ultimate. That's the most you could get. Like the the famous Hope diamonds that everyone knows about from the Titanic. The right. blue is a deep. This one is a 328, fancy light blue. So it's the light tone, but it's blue and it doesn't have any secondary. So what you're seeing is a little bit of blue in it. Very rare. Why is it blue? It's blue because it has boron. Deep in the ground, within a few billion years, under intense heat and pressure, when a boron is there, it's an element, and it's mixed with a colorless diamond, they become blue. And blue are probably the second rarest. What's the After first? red. Red. Yeah, well, we have two greens here. We have a pure green and another green that is mixed. So this one is a carrot 75, fancy yellowy, fancy yellowish green. It means it has a little bit yellow in it. Versus probably one of the, the most rarest diamonds we have True. in inventory right now. True. Here is a 431, fancy intense green. And look at the difference. Look at the difference in the colors. Yeah. So when the diamond within the ground again under immense heat and pressure while it's being evolved, if it was exposed to radioactivity, the radioactivity is turning it into green. So it's not an element. Next, we're moving to pinks. One of my favorites. Pinks are very rare. You hear Sotheby sold the famous 15 karat vivid diamonds for record price of 45 million and 50 million, 55 million. They're very rare. What makes them pink? Same thing, it's the optical thing. It's the yeah. optical thing. So this is um, actually a defect. Right, in the lattice, in, in the, the structure. The, it's a defect right, in the structure. Right, exactly, exactly. Yeah. So this one is a 204 fancy orangey pink. It has a secondary color in it, which is orangey. So the dominant is pink, but it has some hue. The orangey, which makes it look like it's a peachy, peachy color. So it's a peach pink. I like this peach color. Yeah. It's cute. You like it, right? Yeah, I you like always it. like it. Because it's, it's like a sunset. It's like California sunset for me. And this one has purple. This is, this is really, really cool. This one is a carrot 73, fancy purplish pink. And look at the difference. Peach color versus... It's that. different. Yeah, so it different. is different. I'm not sure which one I like better now. Maybe one day this, one day that. The Carrot 40 is one of my favorite diamonds in our inventory. And the reason is because, first of all, it's a straight pink. There's no sure. secondary to it. And most of the time, remember, the more pure the diamond is, less secondary colors, the more rare, and as usual, more rare, more expensive. So this one is a Carrot 40 fancy intense pink so it's really high there on the intensity of the color and it's internally internally flawless it means it's like there's no inclusions whatsoever in it and the color is just superb um, just to give an idea carrot 40 like this 
The retail price on this one is $950,000 and it's only a carat 40. Let me try it on. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> well, I feel very important now. Okay, here we go. Oh, and I have matching uh, color on my hand today. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll leave it on for today. And here is the brown. No, so, so let's tell everybody that brown and pink are coming from the same mine. And uh, let's exactly. talk about and brown again is not another element in the diamond. It's the an optical. Again. That's, yeah, exactly. They come from the same family as the pinks. Right. And most of them are coming, even though they're coming from all over the world, because they're very common. Most of them are coming from the Argyle mine in Australia, which is the mine that produces the most, most of the pinks. diamonds of, the, of, of most of the pinks in, in the, the world. world. Okay. Yeah. The good news and the bad news is that the Argyle mine is closing. The Argyle mine is closing this month, November of 2020, uh, because they just can't find them anymore. They find very little and the mine uh, is pretty much exhausted from pinks. That was the only mine in the world that was actually literally really producing pinks on, on a regular basis to the world. We expect the pink diamonds to go up in value. They they'll become more rare and as usual, more rare, more expensive. So if you're into collecting diamonds, we highly recommend pink diamonds right now. Let's try it here. You need more fingers, Kelly. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, which one you like better for today? The pink. Last but not least, we have natural fancy black diamonds. What is a black diamond really? Black diamond is an early evolution of a diamond. Think about it. If th this diamond would stay in the ground under Im again immense heat and pressure for another baby half a billion years, yeah. it will turn to be Clear. colorless. So this is a baby diamond. This is a baby diamond. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm wearing baby diamonds, a lot of baby diamonds, right. and I, I, I've been wearing this for I don't know six years, black diamonds, and every time people look at my necklace and say. What kind of stone is that? And I tell them it's diamonds. And people are so surprised because right. they've never seen a black diamond. Yeah. Because they sparkle, you still see the sparkle. Right. So, but they're very cool. They're not expensive, very affordable. And lately we've seen a lot of jewelry designers working Using with these. Them. Yeah, and uh, making beautiful pieces of jewelry. 